Now this season, one Green Bay family is spreading holiday cheer with a homemade light show. NBC 26's Noelle Friel shows us how the show is bringing people together and giving back to the community. What started as a small display for neighbors has now grown into a citywide attraction. Two years ago when COVID hit, decided to try the pixel lights, give people something to look forward to in the Christmas time last year. For Green Bay resident Daylin Velotti and his family, the East Ridge Lights Show is a way of giving back to the community. And the past few years, it has only grown bigger. Last year's show was made of about 1,500 lights. This year's show consists of over 4,000, and Daylin says he plans to double it next year. We're actually starting setting up for next year already. It's pretty much a year-round thing. We don't really stop. And this year, the light show is collecting donations for Freedom House Homeless Shelter. For Daylin, it's a cause that hits close to home. I actually grew up in a homeless shelter a little bit when I was a child, so it means a lot to me to give back to them. Daylin says he knows how much these donations mean to someone living in a shelter. As a kid, you know, the donations helped us out a lot because uh, one of the times I spent was around Christmas time, so I remember getting the toys. It was just nice, you know, that some people would help us out. Just, just felt real good. A father of five with one more on the way. Daylin says it's rewarding to see the reaction of children who stop by the show. Most people seem to enjoy it. Like when I see, uh, look out the windows and see kids dancing up and down the driveway. It's pretty nice. Most of the neighbors, they enjoy it. They always come by and say thank you for the display. It, it's nice to see. Shining a light on those in need. In Green Bay, Noelle Friel, NBC 26.